I think, you know, being able to communicate to people is real important. Being transparent and blunt, um, I cut through it. I'm very blunt, um, but not mean-spirited. Um, I like to have fun, and I lead by having fun. I use humor, you know, to connect to people. Um, it's, if you're not entertained, it's impossible to inform people. So there's nothing wrong with having a little levity and a little bit of fun. And I, I just think that, you know, we learned in kindergarten everything you need to know. It's a golden rule. Treat people the way you want to be treated. And I've never varied from that. Okay. So would you say, say that that's been the secret to your success, having that, those core principles? Well, I think that's part of it. I think not having any fear. It was, I've never been asked when, about fear. You know, again, if it's not who you are, but it's what you do, the worst thing that can happen to you is you get fired. So if that's the worst thing that can happen, that's not so bad. You'll go do something else. And so rather than not taking risks, I've taken lots and lots and lots of risks. And they haven't all worked by any means. But for the most part, the smart risks have worked. And it's been able to give me something to own. And what I mean by that is, if you ask people in an organization, give me an accomplishment. It's much easier to evaluate somebody when you can see the success. And success comes from taking risks, intelligent risks. And so whether it's, you know, getting into business with Tyler Perry at Turner or branding channels or creating the Coca-Cola polar bears or building an entertainment experience at Phillips like no other or bring Pac-Man back or some of the things that we've done, it's taking risks. And the day you stop taking risks is a very bad day. Time to retire.